Hello. Hello. How are you doing? Good. You're coming How towards the end of the day. I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. You know what was great was we all got to watch it for the first time last yeah. night, and it kind of gave you a little wind in your sails. Was it kind of like that's what it's all about? Totally. That the second you hear that music, you're just in it. You're yeah. like, oh, it's a, we're in a Star Wars movie. Because was it a big thing for you growing up? Totally. Abs I mean, these are the first movies I think I saw. Definitely the first movie in a movie theater. And good to work with JJ again. So fun. I yeah. mean, there are just certain people you meet along the way that you just have a professional chemistry with. And I, I just know what he thinks is funny. You know, like you speak the same language. When he wants to do another take, I'm like, I know what he wants me to do. And we heard this morning at the press conference that you wouldn't take your helmet off. <laughs> is that true? It is true because that's my dream. Like, I'm sort of an introvert, so to be able to, well, first of all, to wear a cool costume where it's sort of tough, then to put on the helmet, I can see everyone, but no one can see me. It's like ultimate safety and control. It's clearly the best costume, isn't it? It is clearly the best. I mean, to be asked to do a Star Wars movie, but then to get to be one of these characters, I would have done whatever he asked me to do. I would have been, you know, like Yoda's friend, whatever, in the swamp. But to be a cool character with that, dude, win-win. What do you kids think of the whole Star Wars thing? So I have three kids, yeah. and the oldest is 12, who I, I can, with the exception of maybe becoming a professional basketball player, which I don't, I don't think is going to happen at this point in my life, um, nothing I do is impressive, obviously, because I'm a mom. And... Um, when I said, even though they swore me to secrecy that I could tell no one, I instantly told my 12 year old. <laughs> I was like, River, listen to this. You can't tell anyone, but I'm gonna be in Star Wars. And he was like, that is cool. And I was like, yes. But he believed you. I got him. <laughs> yeah, I know, it's true. He believed you, because we would lift the helmet. I, I know, he'd be like, that wasn't you. I was like, yes, it is. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, I, I, I imagined, correct me if I'm wrong, but this is the biggest movie that you've done. Even How Mission Impossible. How it, dare you? I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? Did you not see the spelling series Malibu Shores? Yes. <laughs> no, you didn't. Lies. <laughs> How does it feel to be in it? After, you've, you've had some, some of the younger cast members have kind of been thrust into this yeah. monster. You, you've had a great career already, but perhaps this is, in terms of publicity, it's... This is a pretty massive one, but um, I guess the connection of JJ is extremely comforting because I think that's my end to it. So it's like the connection is JJ first, creating something with JJ, and then the other stuff is this huge peripheral thing. But you know, I come to these things. I'm just talking to JJ, going, "Oh, really? You, oh, you stayed at Disneyland last night? Oh, oh, what, what, oh, you went on the rides? Oh, did you go on Pirates of the Caribbean? You know, I'm not thinking about the magnitude yet. I think going to the premiere might. I might go, oh, 